Thanks, Kevin. We've got a beautiful weekend ahead, and what better way to celebrate it than with a nice, refreshing drink? We're joined now by Kath Gallant of Blue Moon yeah. Evolution in Exeter, which is celebrating 20 years in business just last week. Congratulations. That's right. Thank you very much. Yes, 20 years, and actually, we just launched our spring menu, and so I decided today to celebrate the rhubarb, which we've got <laughs> some. Uh, rhubarb salsa and rhubarb dessert on the menu and actually I have rhubarb growing in my garden so even Fantastic. though things are a little delayed this beautiful perennial which actually originally came from Siberia hmm. and can survive the cold winter right. is a beautiful vitamin rich uh, perennial that really is growing in grandma's backyard and hopefully others so my simple recipe today is I've taken two cups of sliced rhubarb mm -hmm. and um, my secret ingredient is a slice of beet and that's my oh. ruby. So um, you put that in a nice medium sized saucepan with four cups of water and you put that on the stove top and let it simmer for about half an hour. Really you can't almost overcook it. Mm. So and that then, the beet will kind of seep out and make well, it nice and it red. It does. You know, yeah. sometimes the the rhubarb is bright pink enough that huh. you get its own color. Yep. But um, I like to ensure it with just a little <laughs> bit of. Uh, so the other ingredient is a fourth of a cup of honey, wow. and you want to add that after you've heated your rhubarb. So I like to just put it in my vessel, and mm -hmm. you strain this. Let's see if I can get it right in there. Nice work. Thank you. <laughs> a few years experience. Yeah. <laughs> and then if you just give it a stir with the hot rhubarb juice, it the lets just that right up, huh? sweeten it right up. So rhubarb, high in vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin K, hmm. which is good for your bones and your brain. And actually one glass is equal to the amount of calcium as a glass of milk. So oh. really good for you. Right. Let me just set that off to the side. Thank you. So this is my finished product. I've let it cool down. You can keep it in the refrigerator. Mm -hmm. But not only is it a delicious little beverage on its own, but we like to make it into a rhubarb bottini, oh, which is wow. a nice martini <laughs> style, or a rhubarb bellini. <laughs> and actually, here, I'm going to give you a little bit here. Fantastic. You can try it. So right in your own backyard, nature provides some beautiful May Day. Happy May Day, right? You can taste that that's healthy and tasty at the same time. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Congratulations on 20 years in business. Thank you. I appreciate Kath that. Kath Gallant of uh, Blue Moon Evolution in Exeter, right behind downtown in Exeter. Is it's that right on? off the main street in downtown Exeter. Oh, and right. come and join us. Fantastic. Thank Tastes you. Great. We'll Thank be right you. back.